Hey guys, today is a special video, and uh, my grandpa has finally finished meeting, making a book about about World War II, and he would like to share it with you. It's really interesting, okay? All right, here we go. So this is my um, grandpa. His name is uh, Tzvi Glazer. He's a World War II veteran. Say hi, Sapa. Hello. Um, would you like to show everybody about your book? Okay. Uh, this is going to be on TV. All right. I'm just telling them it's going to be on TV because I'm just putting it on YouTube. Okay? It's on YouTube. You know what that is. All right. So show your book to everybody. Just do what you normally do when you see okay. people. Okay. My book is about my life during World War II. Yeah. Um, here, hold it. And, uh, okay. Say it again. This is the uh, title picture in front. What's it uh, called? Yeah, this is in the Russian uniform. And uh, this is the back uh, picture in the uniform of the Israeli military. But what is the book called? The book name is Survivor. Okay. And it's told, it tells my experiences of uh, how I survived uh, many times, uh, almost uh, being... Uh, Killed, eliminated. Then I wouldn't be here. Okay, Saba, so yeah. tell us, all right, face us. Face me? Yeah, so? Face me. All right. So tell us about your life, how um, how you survived during World War II, and about your book and everything. Okay. Tell well, us about the train story, you know. Okay, just tell us about uh, how you escaped and... The Germans attacked, and we ran away, so... And then I, uh, just a, a couple minutes later, the train left. The Germans were already already in, and uh, mother could not reach the, the train. And the, uh, she uh, remained remained at the uh, city uh, with the Germans. And, uh, and she got killed. They called her later uh, and shot her, and she was killed. Well, um, where was it from? Like, where were you? Well, this was Riga, is the main city, the capital city of Latvia. But where were you when during this happened? Uh, during the war, I went to the coal mines, worked as a coal miner, and then one day there was an avalanche right behind me, and almost killed me, but I was lucky and I survived the avalanche. You mean the rocks fell from the underground. But yeah. um, uh, what city were you in when your mother was shot? What city were you in while you were escaping in the train? Oh, this was in Riga, where the train was taking us, the main city of Latvia. Where did it take you? Into Russia. And uh, I heard it took you to the Kyrgyzstan? To Kyrgyzstan. Kyrgyzstan was one of the states of the Soviet Russian country. Okay, so what were you doing in there? I became a coal miner. So you were in, uh, in the coal mines. Um, yeah. uh, what city in Kyrgyzstan? The city at the coal mine was Tashkumir. Okay. Um, how do you feel ha that you're here, lucky, and um, how, did, how did you join the Israeli army? Well, much later, after the end of World War II, I went to Israel, and uh, there I became part of the Israeli army and fought wars against the Arabs. So, what kind of guns did you use in the in the World War Two? In World War Two, we used a gun by name a uh, Simonov, after the creator Simonov. What's the um, interesting? What did you use during? It was the, a rifle. Oh, uh, what did you use during the um, Israeli War? AK forty-seven, right? Yeah, uh, and then a machine gun. By name Pe Pe Shah. And Uzi? After the creator 
Spagi. What about Uzi, the... Now, in the Israeli army, I uh, used the Israeli machine gun by name Uzi. Okay. Interesting. You would like to take some pictures of you. Okay. Sorry. <coughs> now enough. I'm tired now. I don't want any more. Okay, Shaba. Please, I'm tired. All right. All right. Thanks for I'm sharing with us. Um, we'll see who will um, get some more information out of you soon. I'm very tired. Yeah. Good night. Yeah. Good night, everybody. Here is really, it's really hot. It's really. It's night. It's like it's nine thirty right now. Bye.